Hey Aries, welcome back. We gonna go ahead and do a reading for you really quick. See what's going on, what the spirit wants you to know or what do you need to know at this time? What does Aries need to know? What does Aries need to know? Pick up whatever messages we need to pick up for y'all. What does Aries need to know at this time? Aries placement. What does Aries placement mean to know? Okay. What does Aries placement mean to know? Okay, so far, Aries, um, I feel like you're getting some bad news. Uh, it, it may not be you. It may be somebody you know. Um, and I didn't mean to say it like that, but there is a, a message of concern coming in, okay, about an ending. And it can be with a mature man, okay? This person could be having, um, to, you could be having to make a decision, or this could be a court decision, but you could be having to make a decision about ending something, okay? It's going to be some type of physical change of address here. And I also see you right here as a privileged lady, okay? So I do see you getting ready. To, this could be a relationship. Let me see. This could be a relationship ending. What's this judification for Aries? What's judification for Aries? Clarify judification. Judication for Aries. Sorry, y'all. My words are just off a little bit today. What is judication for Aries? Clarify judication for Aries spirit. What is this about? There could have been an argument, a disagreement. Somebody could have put you in some type of competition here. And you block this person. Yeah, you're making a decision to uh, protect yourself from somebody due to the fact that y'all had some type of disagreement, okay? Let me see. Who is this mature man? This could be you, Aries, or the person that um, you ended things with. What's this mature man? Yeah, the ending. For some of y'all, it's the loss of a loved one. My um, condolences, if that is the case. Okay, for some of y'all, but most, and for some of y'all, this is a, a ending of a relationship. Let me see. Give me another one on a mature man. What is this about for Aries? Yeah. Somebody could be coming in to apologize towards you or uh, coming in to give you some type of small offer here. And I feel like you probably shut it down, Aries. Oh, excuse me. I'm sorry, y'all. Clarify coffin for Aries. What's this coffin for Aries? I feel like something is ending here, though. A relationship. Yeah, you're moving forward. Is what I'm seeing here. Yeah. You found out somebody was lying about something. They wasn't telling the truth. Okay, maybe you cut off communication with this person. Maybe it was bad communication between y'all. Okay. Or you're gonna find out somebody somebody telling you not not being honest about something. What's this message of concern? What's the message of concern? It could be a king of wands that you're dealing with. You may get a message of concern about a king of wands, an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius. This person could have left you hanging at some point. That's what this is. This, this person might have ghosted you. Uh-huh. Hold on. Let me see. What's this five of wands for Aries when it comes to adjudication? Somebody made a decision to put you in some type of competition. What's this five of wands? Yep. They could be gossiping about you too. They could be talking about you, investing into others. Okay, is what I'm getting here. It's something that they invested in or they wanted to invest in, but they put you in some type of competition when it came to that. Some of y'all... You could be dealing with an Aquarius, Libra, or a Sagittarius, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Scorpio out here. 
Okay, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, but somebody, um, they do want to heal this. I do see that, but I feel like you're not, you're being very guarded towards this person. What's the seven of wands? What's the seven of wands? Because you felt like this person was being dishonest to you. Yeah, they, the secrets have been exposed. It came out. Either you intuitively found this out or you heard about it. Somebody was talking about it. Or somehow you found out. You could have found out through a reading. What's the moon in reverse? Clarify the moon in reverse. Yeah, that somebody made the wrong decision. This could be some harsh gossip about you too. This person could have gossiped about you as well to other people. Yeah, you don't trust this person. You don't. You're, you're, you're protecting yourself. You've been through too much. You've been through too much and this person has made the wrong decision and in investing in something else. Putting you in competition. And you do not trust this person. You have been hurt before. You probably let this person have it, be, have it because you found out about them being deceitful towards you. Lying, cheating. They could have stole something from you. Took something from you. What's the death card? Bottom of your man. What's the death card? They could have took their cup somewhere else, thinking things were going to work out over there. Look, you put this to a halt. I don't see this thing turning around. For, I don't see this. you taking this person back. You're not waiting on somebody. You, you refuse to wait on somebody. Okay? This person left, left you hanging. What's the uh, Knight of Cups? Clarify the Knight of Cups for Aries. Yeah, they did. Yeah, they did. Uh-huh. Trouble is headed somebody's way, though. It is. They could be dealing with law, with the law. They could, let me see, what's the six of wands? I mean, six of swords in reverse to Aries. This person was, uh, I heard sweet nothings. Yeah, a tower. This person's about to receive some type of tower. Oh, yeah, about some type of contract, some third party. Oh, or it's a third party that could have, could have told you this as well. This person was working with somebody else. For some of y'all, somebody lost their job. What's this three of pencils? What's this three of pencils? For some of y'all, this is a job. There could have been some gossip at work. But you're getting a new one, though. It's like you already knew this, and you, and it was, you already got a new opportunity already as it is. Somebody could have did some type of harsh gossip about you about at work. Could have been some co-workers that was talking mess about you because they was jealous. Okay? Yeah, but whatever it was, they were lying. And um, you can report this, whoever this person is that lied, whether it was a boss, a lover, or a friend, whoever, or a family member, they're not receiving a victory at all. What's this Ace of Swords in reverse? What's this Ace of Swords? Mm. See, they lied on you. Somebody lied on you. They did. They lied on you, Aries. This could be family. Yeah, it could be family that did this too. Or somebody's family. For some of y'all, I'm getting three different scenarios here. Lover, family, and work. So y'all take it as a resonate. What's the ten of uh, cups in reverse? This could be somebody you had a family with as well. Yeah, uh-huh. That could have been like a one-night stand. Somebody could have uh, did to do with somebody else. What's this Ace of Wands? You got a new opportunity, though, too. You moving towards a new opportunity as well. What's this Ace of Wands? Yeah, because something was toxic. But, you know, I feel like somebody's obsessed with you. What's this Devil card with the Ace of, with the Ace of Wands? Oh, my goodness. But they missed out. They ain't regret, though. This person is obsessively thinking about you in, uh... You know what way. But they didn't regret. Somebody crying over spill milk. What's this five of cups? Yeah, because you took a leap of faith somewhere else. Or you're going to. Take a leap of faith to do what? Towards another lover. Or they this is this person left you to go towards somebody else. Take it as a resonate. But some of y'all, this is a lover situation. This person left you hanging. They thought the grass was green on the other side and I didn't want to come back towards you. It didn't work out. Whatever they invested in, it was a lost cause. I could see that for sure. It did not work out. 
Okay, what's the uh, King of Wands? Yeah, somebody was dealing with somebody that was emotionally unavailable. Okay, is what I'm getting here. And they received this bad news from this person. That this person was was very, this person was like, almost like I would say narcissistic or just given, you could, if this is you, you could have been giving too much of yourself to this person. Okay, hold on, what's this Queen of Cups in reverse? But somebody is, they, they got a nasty attitude, whoever this person is, this Queen of Cups. What's the Queen of Cups? They could have been given to this Queen of Cups and left you hanging. Where did card go? Yep, this was exposed. It was exposed that this person was given to two different people. What else? Put a Queen of Cups in reverse. Yeah, somebody had to make a decision between two people is what I'm getting here. It's almost like they plan to go towards this person. This person could have left that person hanging. Too, as well as what I'm getting for some of y'all. They was dealing with somebody that left them hanging and now they want to try to come back and bring an offer to you. That, that love bomb offer crap. What's the hangman? Yeah, this person left them hanging, Aries. They did. And now they want to come, come back towards you after finding out this information. Okay? They want to come back towards the Empress. Okay? Now they're watching you. After the fact that this person left them hanging. This person could have gaslighted, gaslighted your person or the person you was with. They was dealing with a, with a karmic. And now they want to try to come back towards you and apologize after things didn't work out. Because they made the wrong choice. They was a gossip about, gossiping about you to this person too. They was. Mm-hmm. They was. Anything else for Aries? What's the uh, key on this energy on the table for Aries? Yeah, somebody, you probably got a tarot reading on this part, uh, to find out the truth, and you found out the truth, or you either, either you're a reader, okay? Look at this, karmic ties. This is something that you need to let go. This person wasn't right for you, no way. It's coming, y'all. Or this person was dealing with a karmic. And uh, this person cut ties with them, cut them off or something. Yeah, this could have been your twin. Uh-huh. This could have been your twin that was dealing with a karmic. Like I said down here, they thought that this person was a person. Come to find out that person left them hanging. And they, they come bringing this love offer to the empress. They want to reconcile with you. After they done moved on, now they want to try to come move back with you. Uh -uh. Hold on. Yep. Yeah. Some of y'all, this was a workplace affair for some of y'all. That's not for everybody. Okay. This person was not happy. Because somebody, ooh. Mm -mm. Somebody was, had some secrets, though. They was doing some stuff. The person that they was dealing with could have been, uh, could have been on a DL or like... Or that person is your person. Yeah, this person was in a karmic energy. They weren't ready for a real empress. They wasn't. Thinking mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This person that they was dealing with could have been jealous of you as well. They was talking about you to this person. They were. They was. They had a very toxic lifestyle with this person. They was doing some things they had no business doing. And they realized that they was under a spell. For some of y'all, okay? You done moved on for some of y'all, either with yourself or whether with you got a new boo or not. Okay, but this definitely, uh, the tea is definitely coming out here. The truth has been exposed. Anything else? Yep. Mm -hmm. Somebody was under a love spell. They came up out of that love spell. Either they left this person hanging or um, you let, this person left you hanging or it, that person left them hanging, something like that. I do know that they was dealing with a karmic and they was being two-faced towards you. She, it was the person that your person was. And I feel like your person um, was under a love spell, but when it came out, they started arguing, they started, you know, bickering and stuff. That's what this... This one, your person realized that they made the wrong decision. Okay? Yeah. Maybe that's the Aries. Mm 
But yeah, they messed up over you, Aries. They is. They know they messed up. They know they messed up. Mm-hmm. They know they messed up. Let's see. What else for Aries? What else for Aries there? You are being guided right now. You being guided towards your purpose or you already in your purpose. Okay. Or you was guided to get away from this person somehow. Okay. Because this person, this person wasn't ready for you. They had a whole lot of stuff that they wanted to do, you know, in a different way. You get what I'm saying? If that makes sense. You know what I mean? And now you see the truth. You see it through the fog when it comes to this situation. You have gotten clear since you had just, you know, haven't been around this person. This person left you hanging for somebody else. And now you're seeing the truth. That's too many. Yeah. Now this person stuck at a fork in the road because they don't know whether to come towards you or move forward. They don't even know if you will accept them. But you don't trust them right now. You don't. They put you through too much. But some of y'all, some of y'all just been through a lot and you just done. Yeah, because this person is not who they said they are. Some of y'all, this, this person got catfished by a whole nother woman. And look, now they start thinking about the past. They stuck in the past now on uh, how things used to be. Okay, because they were projecting on you. Okay, some of y'all, this person could do music or you could do music or somebody could be in the public eye is what I'm getting here. This person was childish. Okay, this person could be trying to astro project towards you and your dreams at night. Yeah. But you inspire this person. You do. You inspire them. That's for sure. Some of y'all in the public eye. Or something you do that they that they look they look at you in high honors. You know. Yeah, this see they thought this was funny though too. Whoever they, they family or this person or whatever, they thought it was funny, you know, to confuse you, to uh, talk about you, be two-faced towards you with this person. They was laughing, giggling, and doing their thing, okay? And now this person that left them, walked out of their life, not the person that they thought that, it was, that, that this person was, whether it's male or female, okay? And now they in regret. They in regret over you. They, they really messed up. Let me see. What's the spiritual message for um, Aries? What's the spiritual message for Aries? Hold on, y'all. What's the spiritual message for Aries? Mm -hmm. Three of Pentacles. Focus on your work. Focus on um, your happiness and what you build in your family legacy. That's what they want you to do. And that's what you've been doing for some of y'all, okay? Because this person, they, they got control issues. They like, this person got their back turned towards you, but spirit wants you to step into your power. They want you to balance out your masculine and your feminine energy, okay? Yeah, because this person, they, they, they wasn't right. They was manipulative, okay? Spirit guided you to move away from this person. Let this person move. If they wanted to move, let them move. Six of Cups. This person was selfish too. They breadcrumbed you for some of y'all. Okay, and those words that they spoke on you and how they was hating on you, they receiving a karma for this too. They are. They was very controlling. See, they probably dealt with a person that's, that's um, controlling them. How they did you, they met their match. How they left you hanging, that person left them hanging. Okay? And now they're juggling. They, they, it's, they dealing with an imbalance. Okay? Some of y'all, y'all see this very clearly. You're not confused anymore at all about this situation. Spirit said, continue to focus on you. Continue to focus on your healing. Don't worry about what they did behind your back because whatever it is that they did is going to come back. I see it going back to them. Okay? So that's what I got for y'all. I love y'all. Be blessed. Namaste. Ashe, ashe,